Hello. I am on a morning walk to the bus stop. I'm pretty much back in the same area I was the night before with less people. It's kind of nice. Also, the party stopped. Um, that was the Arab festival, which happens every year. And it's two days, so they're gonna start again sometime today. Boy, was it a, a blast. And yes, that coffee kept me up. <laughs> Here I am on my ride to Banff and here's the benefit to solo traveling. Expect the unexpected. I had a seat all to myself on my way there and on my way back. And I got to enjoy this view very peacefully. No one bothered me. <laughs> so I made it to my destination. That was quite a lovely ride. Just used the uh, facilities and gonna figure out what I wanna do next. Check out this spot, it's a hotel. So cute. From here we are headed straight to the Banff Gondola. My name is Jake, I'll be your driver for the next 10 minutes or so. Should you have any questions, feel free to let me know. Otherwise, sit back, relax, enjoy the ride. <laughs> so yes a benefit to solo traveling is the chance for you to meet great new people and a fun fact about one of the ladies i met is she has a fear of heights so that's another thing is you're able to challenge yourself in a way that you would probably never do. And it's either talking to someone new or getting over one of your fears or challenging yourself to a point that you push yourself to do something so incredibly brave and amazing for these views. <laughs> Precipitation way up here. 
feels like hail and it feels like rain lower on the bottom here but y'all ready for this You can read that? Yeah. <laughs> this is the end of the boardwalk. Here we are. Started way over there. Now we're here. Rainbow! Well, that was totally worth it. Also returning back and I'm in a gondola all to myself. 360 view. Money well spent, I have to say. And Canada, you are the true north. <laughs> As you say, man, I don't even have words to describe what I experienced. I really don't. But basically, I'm gonna head back down, get back on the shuttle, um, back to um, downtown Banff, and then I need to get on my bus back to Calgary. So, I'll see y'all back in Calgary. So here, I'm getting a moment to just self-reflect, which is another benefit of solo traveling. I am so grateful for such an opportunity. I don't take these things for granted. Um, and just to be able to sit there and make my way down and having another look at the incredible nature. I even had an opportunity to take some photos. Why not? <laughs> Oh, but before I leave beautiful Banff, I figured I'd give y'all a glimpse of what that city, that small town looks like. Just beautiful, right? All right, as promised, I made it back to Calgary. Um, got rained on on my walk back to my hotel, but that's okay. Um, just to recap this trip, it was everything. I came in without a plan. Um, and leaving here with a lot of energy, a lot of insight, especially talking to Maria about the mental health and wellness program they have um, set up for individuals who live in this province. Um, what else? The people, just Calgarians, <laughs> Canadians, very friendly, just very inquisitive and want to know more about um, um, just you as a person, even just walking by and saying hello and then maybe stopping and wanting to have a conversation, definitely has Oregon beat. <laughs> um, also, downtown um, Calgary is very like people friendly as far as like walking. You don't really need a car here. And so I walked just about like 90% except for when I left Calgary, or yeah, I left Calgary to Banff and I was on a bus and I was very peaceful. So you watched this far and I totally appreciate you hanging out with me and learning more about um, what keeps me going um, as a therapist. I need to do things about myself sometimes and I think we all need to really take that in and I hope you learned some of the benefits of doing things alone, traveling solo, all of that. It's absolutely my pleasure to produce things like this and to um, provide some insight. So thank you for watching. If you have any questions, comments, I'm going to put most of what I did in the description as far as like information goes. Um, but let us know what you have in the comments so that we can answer some questions for you. Where should I go next? Bye. <laughs>